Yo, what is up guys and welcome in some Frontal Cut here with some news about The Walking Dead, the final season, mostly about the PC platform and also some little bit of goodies that were on this little bit of news. So, there was an announcement that The Walking Dead, the final season, will not be reappearing on other PC platforms like Steam and GOG. So, if you want to buy it on Steam, you can't. You can't do that because they have announced they're actually partnering up with the Epic Games Store. Yes, the Epic Games Store, the Fortnite Store. But of course, if you have a game already on Steam, you can definitely get episodes 3 and 4, but you can no longer purchase the games on Steam or GOG. That's definitely due to the higher revenue share that was announced by Epic Games. That's their store platform they're going to be pushing to rival Steam. Steam offers a a 30% revenue share and I guess Epic Games offers about like 12% I think so that's definitely has to be the case there. They want that dev friendly revenue share so it will now be exclusively purchasable on the Epic Games store. So I was like hey Epic Games store okay I'm not personally enticed by the store but let's go ahead and look at the, the thing, oh here it is, The Walking Dead, oh wow that's pretty cool, oh that's new, and what? Screenshots? What? Okay, so that's definitely the case here, these are definitely all episode 3, but these are small, so I'm gonna go over to my folder and get the bigger version, so here we go, screenshots of episode 3, let's start off with this one, if I can go full screen, but bam, here we have one of 10. And then we have Willie looking very, very mean, Clementine looking surprised, Lewis looking kind of surprised, and Ruby over here with the shovel. So, this seems like Willie might have pushed down 10 because he might have made fun of Mitch or something like that because that's definitely Mitch over on the ground. So, he might have badmouthed Mitch and Willie could have pushed him down. Because Willie and Mitch are definitely best friends, kind of, they're definitely really cool with each other. So it would make sense that Willie might have pushed down 10. That could spark a bit of bad blood between them. Because Willie is definitely, he kind of hostile. He did end up punching uh, a Sim. So he might have pushed a button, or 10 might have pushed a button with Willie. So that could be a, a potential bit of badness between those two. So that's definitely really possible there. Going on, we have one of Violet, okay? So this one is like the only one that has Violet in it. And we have Clem looking kind of concerned a little bit on her knees. We have Violet, of course, sitting down. This could be after the whole kidnapping of the other people in the group where Clem goes to Violet to kind of go ahead and cheer her up or talk to her about the situation because this looks like one of those moments that they would have, you know, Violet's over here talking all depressed like and that usually happens a lot, so that could be what's going on here, okay? So definitely they are in the boarding school and, you know, a, another one of the Violet talks, the conversations that they usually have. So moving on, we have one that seems like it's just Clementine, but then in, in the background we have blurriness and what seems to be, of course, what is Ruby with the shovel. This could be her digging the grave for Mitch, although they weren't really the nicest people to each other. They definitely do, you know, they do have a little bit of, you know, uh, friendliness because they have lived with each other for a while. So this could be her actually digging the grave for Mitch. Definitely really cool to see here. Moving on, we have one. It's nighttime. We have Clementine, AJ, Ruby, Tin, and of course, Willie. And Clementine seems to be giving some kind of speech about what's going on. It's night, so it could be the infiltration of the Delta camp. So that's definitely really, really interesting there. I'm not sure the exact possibility of what's going on here, but it's definitely looking pretty cool. Ruby's looking kind of doubtful. You know, we have Tim looking down at the ground. I'm not entirely sure what exactly is going on here, but it's definitely really cool to see. Moving on, we have this one. We have Clementine and AJ. Clementine's giving a very, very, very mean face. And then we have AJ over there, hands crossed. Kind of like, okay, definitely. This is a really, really, really good looking screenshot. Like, really good. I'm, I'm like, wow, this is a really good screenshot. But, of course, Clementine's looking very mean. For what reason? 
Abel over here in the kitty chair, the desk and everything, he's all tied up and everything, bleeding out his nose and everything, all that kind of stuff. Clementine and AJ are here as well. Definitely not being very cooperative, I would assume, with the interrogation that we're going to go ahead and give him in episode 3 because we want to go ahead and find out the location of the Delta camp. Okay, so interrogation, Bigby Wolf style, definitely has to be underway here. This is definitely like one of my favorite screenshots. Like these two right here definitely speak a lot of cool things, okay? And even Abel's face is just really cocky. I really don't I really don't know why. It's just really cocky. I don't know. It's definitely really awesome. Moving on, we have this one, which is pretty much Clementine and AJ out in the woods. It's daytime. They're on the rock sitting down. Not entirely sure why they are alone. Hopefully they like aren't really separated from the group. That would be very, very concerning. So I'm not sure what's going on. This could be, you know, after the whole everything in episode three. I'm not entirely sure, but it's definitely really cool to see here. Moving on, we have the one with AJ with the blood on his face. Not entirely sure why he has blood on his face, by the way. Uh, this is the finger gun thing at Lily. And there's cardboard boxes on the floor, so I'm not entirely sure where this is at. But moving on, we have one of a walker. A walker. Definitely looking really nice. We, of course, we've seen them a lot, but I want to point out they look very nice, okay? It seems to be night, or almost night, but there seems to be a light source going towards the walker. I'm not entirely sure. It could be like a floodlight or something like that, a spotlight. So, this could be near a camp or something, I'm not sure. I could be wrong, it could be the sun, I don't know. It's very dark out. Who knows, right? Anyways, moving on, we have one that definitely has a spotlight. And we have Clementine and Lewis hugging. And they aren't very happy. What's going on here? They're out in the woods and it seems to be night. And there seems to be a floodlight. This could be near the Delta camp, I'm not entirely sure, but hey, this can't paint a good picture because they aren't really smiling, they're just like hugging and their faces aren't happy. For what reason? It's very, very concerning, but hey look, a nice scene with Clementine and Lewis hugging, so there definitely is going to be some more affection for them in episode 3, which is good to see for the Lewis and Clementine shipper fan people, okay? But other than that, I think this is a no, 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 no. Not the last one. We have one of Lily and Clementine. Of course, that Clementine with her hands on her hips. We have Lily looking kind of mean, okay? She's sitting down. She has a gun, so she's obviously the one in charge here. This could be at the Delta, so that definitely could be what that is. And of course, she's the one in charge. She has the gun. So she's asking the questions here, and I'm wondering what's going on here, okay? So definitely we are getting some talk time with Lily, which is definitely what I want. That's definitely really, 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 really awesome and exciting. I can't wait for this because I want to go ahead and speak to her and talk to her and possibly redeem her. I don't know, but that would definitely be really awesome. I cannot wait for this to be in a room with Lily talking to her hopefully not with that gun pointed at my head that would definitely be uh, really appreciated Lily okay but anyways moving on to the last one I believe nope yeah technically last one we have the last one which is basically Clementine and James once again you can see him this is this is just beautiful they're out in the woods it's daytime we have him with his hand over on his little arm there and there seems to be a bandage a bandage there this is this is really detailed i'm sorry I'm, it's beautiful but anyways so he's looking very worried very scared so something had to go down here that could actually get him you know wounded but this is bandaged already so i'm wondering if it happened before what if he what if lily and them came for him and then he ran off to clementine to look for help that could definitely be a possibility there so looking forward to seeing more of james he definitely is coming back and could play an integral role in the episodes to come. 
that's definitely really awesome there so Clementine's here I wonder if the rest of the group will go ahead and meet him that would definitely be really awesome but other than that we have this little cool one of Clement AJ definitely really cool to see this but other than that that's all we have for the video as of right now those are all the screenshots for episode 3 and it was about them going ahead and moving exclusively to the epic game store all the links to the stuff will be down in the description box below i'll link the little article here i'll link the little store here so you can see it yourself various things like that so go ahead and comment down below what you guys are thinking is going to happen in all of the screenshots go ahead comment down below any theories and stuff like that do so i want to see them because episode three is about less than a month away we're almost there and we get to see the awesomeness that the developers wanted us to see and all that kind of stuff like that so comment down below go ahead and give me a thumbs up if you guys have liked the video and of course subscribe to inferno gun that's me for more awesome Walking Dead content like this on the channel. I'm Infernal Kun, and I'll catch you guys next time on The Walking Dead.